a movement called No Justice, No Peace recently visited Rancho Cucamonga to draw attention to racial and economic justice. Artists painted one big sidewalk mural outside of Los Amigos Elementary School to reflect the community values of residents who are often overlooked. Music Changing Lives founder Josiah Bruni took charge in organizing the tour to spread peace, love, and awareness. We came up with the idea of doing the No Justice, No Peace mural, uh, where it was K-N-O-W, uh, where we want to know what justice is and we want to know what peace is within our communities. The mural that we recently did in Rancho Cucamonga, it speaks to the purpose that we need to be kind, we need to be loving uh, and have hope. Uh, for those that are growing. With the mural addressing many important issues, the artists stress the community involvement in the project that reflects local support for change and awareness. This mural in particular was that it was really fully encompassing for a lot of different messages. We really listened to the community when they were, when we were painting as artists, the community told us that they wanted to see people who look like them, that they wanted to see senior citizens. They wanted to see people with disabilities, superheroes that inspire them. I see a lot of playfulness. Uh, I feel like it allowed us as artists to play, but in return, it allowed the community and the children to play and it makes them feel welcome to, in their own neighborhood. Coordinator Bruni and the artists explain how art has healing qualities and can help bring together a community that may have been left out in the past. We are the second responders, meaning artists. Uh, we're out healing our community, but doing it in a different manner than a first responder, but we are as important as that first responder. I think that there's a definite need for art in all places uh, to inspire other children and uh, even adults to just play, be creative. I believe we as artists, we serve as bridges and that we help to bring art into community. So if, if what surrounds us is beautiful art and messages and inspiring, powerful, motivational, you know, expressions, then we are going to see those expressions as an expression of ourselves. For PBS NewsHour Student Reporting Labs, I'm Samantha Johnson from Rancho Cucamonga, California.